Hi, I'm Morten Gans Pedersen, and you're watching Rovers Chat. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to yet another video on the Rovers Chat. Another day, another signing. I'm sure Twitter's blowing up. I'm sure everywhere's blowing up right now about this one. We have signed 19 year old Tyler Morton from Liverpool on a season long loan deal. And you know, exciting, exciting news. It's uh, good to really establish ourselves and get these players in. It was only four days ago, we weren't linked with anyone, we weren't going to be signing anyone. Before you know it, three, four days, a couple of signings in, you can't complain. You might have heard of the movie before, Morton Here's a Who, but we're not here for that. We're here. Who is Tyler Morton? Hopefully, with a little bit of background on the, the Liverpool Academy, I can tell you a little little thing or two about uh, the young 19-year-old who's just signed. Um, as uh, some of you may know, I've, I've probably said it enough on this channel before, I've got a brother who's uh, currently... In the under 23s academy setup and i believe it or not i got to watch him a bit i got to support him and one of the players that was stood out in the premier league two this year was tyler morton i mean you only need to look at his stats to believe it he's played 33 games over the past couple of years i believe seven seven assists six goals i mean if you're not impressed by that then you know you, you need to give your head a wobble because everyone was really excited about Dylan McConde coming and stuff like that. He's a forward and yeah, his goals must have might have been a lot higher, but this guy's a midfielder nearly nearly matching these stats. And, you know, it's crazy to think about how how we've gotten into position in the first place to even bring in such a, pr a prolific player. I mean, you only have to look at him. Pretty sure on Instagram, he's got more more followers than the all than, than us already. I'm pretty sure he's got more followers than Rovers. He's highly, highly rated at Liverpool. Highly. I mean, this this youngster, last time someone was highly as rated as this at Liverpool, an English youngster anyway, probably was Harvey Elliott. And, you know, I'm not going to start with the Harvey Elliott comparisons already. That would be unfair of me. That's a very, very high bar to set. Um, Harvey Elliott came and, you know, did absolutely amazing for us, you know. And it's become a bit of a, a reputation to... Uh, to buy from Liverpool now, get a season-long loan in. It just feels like an obligation now, doesn't it, really? The past uh, three years, including this one now, we've we've signed a, a season-long loan. And, you know, if you look at the, the past two, Harvey, Harvey Elliott and Leighton Clarkson, you've got two very, very different players on your hand. You've got Harvey Elliott where, if we got offered him back on a loan anytime soon, we'd snap our fingers and we'd be signing him without a shadow of doubt. We'd be getting him in just like that. Then you've got Leighton Clarkson. Where I'm not going to say anything, you know. I think I've been bad enough on the channel mm. recently about wearing Nyambe and another another player. So, you know, I'm not going to. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not here for any more slander. I'm. I'm going to be. You're going to get nice, Matt. Today, you're gonna, I'm. I'm in a positive mood. Mm. We've just signed Tyler Morton. I'm going to be nice, and um, yeah, I, it's safe to say that it wasn't the best signing with Leighton Clarkson. But a lot of people are scared with. Um, you know, the same situation happening. You know, I've had a lot of DMs on Twitter saying, oh, isn't he similar to Leighton Clarkson? Isn't isn't he just going to be Leighton Clarkson V2? You know, and I'm here to say no, definitely not. What I've seen, I've seen both play at youth, a youth level and I'm telling you now, Tyler Morton's got something about him. I mean, you need to look at the opportunities he's been given compared to Leighton Clarkson. Unbelievable. I mean... He made his debut against Norwich in the Carabao Cup, I believe. And I mean, you can see that here. Here it is. Mm -hmm. There he is in all his glory with his uh, debut at Norwich. And yeah, you know, people say the Carabao Cup, classic, classic cup for the youth players to, you know, get an opportunity in. But it's not just that. It doesn't stop there with Tyler Morton. And that's what I love, you know. He's played, he's played three games in the Carabao Cup. He's got two Premier League appearances. And he's only gone and played in the mm. Champions League as well against AC Milan, I believe it was. And, you know, not not just anyone gets put into that situation. You don't just chuck some random youngs from the bench and go, you know what, yeah, give him a go. You've got to see something about them. And, I mean, he showed that under-18s level, he got given a... Or under-19s level, one of the two, he got given a he got given a four-year contract. And, I mean, just look at Liverpool's team right now. Liverpool's team is unbelievable. To even break onto the bench in Liverpool's team... Klopp's going to be seeing something about you. Klopp's going to be looking at you and thinking, I see some serious, serious talent here. And, you know, for him to be on against AC Milan, getting on, getting onto the pitch, Klopp's definitely seen something there. And I think, you know, this will be a perfect chance for him to really shine. You know, he's, he's, he's had 
it's 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 bad you know it's 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 a bad thing to say really well not a bad thing you know it's something that you'd be surprised to say about a 19 year old but he's got a, he's got a lot more you know opportunities than any of our team right now he's he's been given a lot more anyway so hopefully he can bring a bit of quality a bit of you know that lower premier league side about him and i, I think he will he's a very versatile midfielder he plays the killer through ball he controls the game you know i'm not going to compare him to the likes of xavi and iniesta i'm not going to hype him up to be something like that as much as i really want to because deep down i really know He's not gonna. He's not gonna. He's not gonna hit the ground running straight away. He's not gonna come in first game and give you three assists or two assists or whatever. Whatever you guys may be expecting from such a highly rated youngster. But one thing he will give you is he's full on the pitch. And you know we've we've signed similar players. It, uh, well, we've signed the one player who is very similar in that aspect, Callum Styles. With the fact, not Callum Styles. Hopefully, Callum Styles soon. Callum Britton, sorry, Callum Britton coming in, and you know he's he's spoken in an interview recently about how passionate he is and how he gives it a hundred percent every ninety minutes. And you know this is something you're gonna get with Tyler Morton as well. He's 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 giving it his all ninety minutes through and through. And I mean, if he wants to be breaking into that Liverpool team next season, this is this is an opportunity. And you guys got to look. We are the stepping stone here, but we're a major stepping stone in his, in his, his career. We are. We're massive, absolutely massive for his career. So it's not going to be a, sep a stepping stone like some players were. They're like, oh, we'll take it lightly, you know. Let's just get past this stepping stone and then we can move on to, like, the big dogs and hope for the best. No, this is serious. This is make or break for him. If he wants to get into that Liverpool team and start breaking through, 19, 20, 21, that's the ages you want to be doing it. That's the, that's the age you want to make your name for yourself. You mean... Harvey Elliott before his injury, he did it for himself and, you know, he's going to be there. He's going to be up and there. And this is something Morton's going to want as well. So he's going to bring a lot, a lot, a lot to Blackburn, a lot of passion. You know, we, you know, we're very heavy on our youth as well. And moving on to the versatility, we know, we know that um, JDT, John, uh, John uh, Dahl Thomason loves a bit of versatility. He absolutely adores it. I think him being able to play anywhere in that midfield region gives it that Let's say, you know, we know Dak, very injury prone. We know if he comes out of the team that, you know, Morton's gonna Morton's gonna have to come in there. He's gonna have to he's gonna have to come in and do his job. And he, that he will. And you know, personally what I believe is I think give him five games and he's gonna be a regular starter for Blackburn and we're gonna be singing his praises, we're gonna be wanting him back on loan again the next season, like we did with Harvey Elliott, and we might see him in the Liverpool Liverpool starting eleven next year. But you know, I want to know all your guys' opinions on it. Um, so make sure to drop some comments below. You know, give this give this video a like if you disagree with me. I want to hear it. I want I want to know everyone's opinions on it all. But thank you all again for watching. Just a short video. It's hard to give you a full. You know what what to expect from a player when you don't you don't know what you're gonna get from him. I can give you my opinion on what I I think you're gonna get from him. Like I have done. I, I've got nothing but positivity to absolutely scream about this player. But you know he's only he's 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 an under twenty three and he's coming into this team and he won't he won't be the make or break straight away he he's gonna he's gonna take a while to get into it but you know he will he will get there and when I say that Rovers fans I mean he will so thank you very much for watching like I said comment all your opinions even if they're gonna be dodgy even if they're gonna contradict me I want to hear them all I'll reply to you all and yeah make sure to subscribe hit the bell for more signings because I can guarantee we're not gonna stop here we're on a rampage we're on a roll. We're gonna we're gonna get at least four more signs. You've heard it here first. So thank you once again and take care guys.